Hello, hi everyone. Today I'm going to explain to you how to prepare insoluble salts using precipitation reaction. In this example, we're going to prepare insoluble salt of silver iodide. In order to form silver iodide, we need two soluble salt as the reactant, which is silver nitrate and potassium iodide. When potassium iodide is mixed with silver nitrate, instantaneously you're going to obtain two layers of mixture. The first layer would be your soluble salts of potassium nitrate. Meanwhile, the precipitate will be the insoluble salt silver iodide. Next, we filter to separate the precipitate. After we filter the precipitate, we're going to wash it with distilled water in order to make sure that all potassium nitrates is being removed from silver iodide. Next, we will dry the residue in between filter paper to obtain our pure product of silver iodide. Now, let's try a question to test your understanding. Draw the steps involved in preparing insoluble salt lead 2 iodide from lead 2 nitrate and potassium iodide. So today, I'm going to show to you how to prepare lead iodide from lead nitrate and potassium iodide. So first of all, we need to come up with the general equation of that reaction. So the equation for that reaction is lead nitrate PB and O3 bracket 2 equals react with potassium iodide, which is also an aqueous to form your insoluble salt lead iodide which is solid form plus potassium nitrate which is an equals form so basically this reaction can be uh, summarized into four parts which is mix and then filter after that wash and dry so let's look all of these four steps into detail first of all you need to mix in lead nitrate with potassium iodide instantaneously you're going to get a mixture of solution and a precipitate this precipitate would be your lead iodide which, our, which is our insoluble salt and the solution will be our potassium nitrate so in order to separate our lead iodide we need to go through a filtration okay what do we require in filtration is a filter funnel and also a conical flux to capture our filtrate so the residue will be captured in the filter paper which is our lead iodide and the future will be our potassium nitrate okay. once we get our insoluble salt in the filter paper we need to wash them with distilled water all right why do we need to wash them with distilled water because we need to ensure that any excess of potassium nitrate that might be stick into our lead iodide is fully removed and been filtered out. Okay, so once we wash them, we transfer our residue into a dry filter paper to dry them, to dry the salt into crystal. Okay. So this is our detailed steps in preparing insoluble salt you have to mix and then filter after that wash straight away to dry voila you're done thank you for watching